Alright, ladies and gentlemen, so this is going to be our first ever time weaving. So, weaving is when you are going to put two different pieces of paper together to make it a new piece of paper. Um, so, they get really strong, um, to make a checkerboard pattern. And there's a lot of different things around you that are woven. So, if you see a braid, that's been woven. And if you look at your clothes, you look really, really closely to it, that's been woven too. So we're going to learn how to weave on our own. So you're going to get this piece of paper, and this is what's going to become your house later on. So we're going to fold it in a hamburger fold, pulling it over, matching up those two edges, pushing out, and just going along my crease. I'm going to keep it folded, and I'm going to take my ruler, and I'm going to match it up right along that open edge. See how that edge opens right there? So along the open edge, and it has to be along the open edge. And then when you use a ruler, you're gonna make your fingers stretch the hand that you don't write with, stretch it out as wide as you can, and you're gonna press down on the ruler. Then you're gonna take your pencil, you're gonna take your pencil, but I'm using a marker so you can see, and you run it right along the edge of your ruler. Then you're gonna turn your ruler and you're gonna you go up and down now. And from that edge down, you're gonna keep going all the way across. Remember, notice I have my fingers stretched really, really far apart. I press down, I'm pressing down with this hand, and I take it and I make sure my pencil is right along that edge. And then I move it, press down, pencil right along that edge, I go all the way up, starting right at that line that I drew going the other way. Notice my fingers also aren't over my ruler, because if they're over my ruler, I can't get there. So I have to be on my ruler, press down, and draw, and then this is going to be my last one. Okay. So I'm going to put my pencil away, and now we're going to put the rulers back. Put my ruler away, and I'm going to take my scissors. I'm going to hold my paper, and I'm going to cut along the up and down lines. I'm going to cut all the way up and stop. Cut all the way up, open my scissors wide, and stop. So this is going to be our stop line. We're going to stop right there. Make sure you get all the way up to that line and stop right before you go over it. So open up your scissors nice and wide. And it's done. Notice that I'm cutting through both of them. This is the folded edge right here, because if I cut along the open edge, these won't be stuck together at the end, and that's what you want. You want them to be together. So I'm going to put my scissors away now, I'm going to open this back up. If you notice, there are these little things. So, we're going to stop here, and this is the first thing that we're going to do.